To connect your YAMP store with Intrag, simply log into your Intrag dashboard and go to the integration section. Here, if you scroll at the end, you'll see the YAMP app card available over here. Click on connect to Intrag and hit next. Once you hit next, you can see all the popular workflows that are available for the YAMP integration. For this video, I will show you a demonstration as to how you can send out an automated WhatsApp notification whenever an order is placed on your YAMP store. To do so, simply select the order place workflow, hit install. Once the workflow has been installed, simply click on edit settings. In the first step, it will ask you to enter your Gampi credentials. To do so, simply go to your Gampi store. To get your API credentials of your Gampi store, simply click on the top right corner and go to API credentials. Here you can see your token and the secret key. Enter your token, enter your secret key and hit connect. Similarly, to authenticate your Interact account, enter your Interact secret key which can be found from your Interact account by going to the settings menu, developer settings and simply copy the secret key. Hit connect. Now that you have authenticated both your Gampi account and your Interact account, simply go to the next step of flow configuration. Select your store. Since in this case I have two test stores that I have, I'll be selecting the one where I'll be placing an order. Let's suppose I'll select this one. And all you need to do is hit activate. Once your workflow has been activated successfully, to ensure that the messages now go out as soon as an order is placed, first we'll go back to the Interact platform and create a template. For this case, I've already created a test template. I'll just quickly show that to you. So as you can see in the template, uh, it's in the Portuguese language wherein it says uh, hello and the name of the customer. Your order has been played successfully. Click on the button below to view your order details. And as you can see, I've given a call to action button in the WhatsApp template so that customers can just click on the button and view their order details. One important note over here is to ensure that you send out the uh, unique uh, order link to your customers, please ensure to enter your uh, store's uh, URL over here, which is let's suppose this in this case. And after that, you can append this particular path into the URL, which is Mina Conta slash uh, meos perios and after that simply add a variable basically what this variable will do you can map your unique customers order id over here and then simply send out that unique order url to the end customer all right now since i already have this template approved as you can see on the top right corner the next step is to set up the automated campaign. Simply go to the notification section. Click on new campaign. Start from scratch. You can write or the campaign name. Let's suppose order placed 2025 test. In the first step, you'll select the notification type as ongoing. From here, you can select the, the event name as order placed. Let's suppose I'll select this. You can also set up as to whether you want to send out this template immediately or with a delay. Let's just, in this case, I'll be selecting immediately. Once you've mapped the first step, go to the next step. Select the template. Let's suppose I'll select the order place template click on choose template now here you'll have to map the values to the variables so for this I'll be mapping the field as name for this order placed 
order number similarly for this again we will be mapping it as order placed and the order number once all of this is done simply hit done to move to the next step you can skip this step in case you want to give any of the other automations over here like opting out and so on you can select otherwise you can just skip to the next step here ensure that you schedule your message as immediately and also stop sending as never this ensures that the campaign will never end unless and until manually paused by one of the owners or the admins of the account once this is done simply set live all right your campaign has been created successfully now let's just test it out by placing an order all right i have placed an order to check this i'll just simply open one of the owners to whom i've sent the message as you can see today's date and i've received the order placed event over here on my whatsapp i've also received the message that i had configured earlier in this video 